Well, after nearly a year of digging for answers, federal investigators now know why a Carnival cruise ship slammed into a pier at the Port of Baltimore. WJZ is live in South Baltimore. Amy Yancey explains what went wrong with the Carnival Pride. Amy? Well, Denise, investigators say the ship was working just fine. The problem was with the crew. Sky Topper 13 over the chaotic scene after the Carnival Pride crashes into a pier at the Maryland Cruise Terminal. The May 26 collision wrecks the passenger bridge, crushes three parked cars, and jolts passengers still on board. Heard a, like a crash and felt it. And then you heard something from the outside crashing as well. The crash causing more than $2 million in damage left Port Authority officials demanding answers. We are eager, as much as Carnival and, and the Coast Guard, to find out exactly what happened. Now, the National Transportation Safety Board says human error is behind the docking disaster. The new accident brief details how the staff captain realized that the angle of approach was, quote, too steep and the speed was too fast and that repeated attempts to transfer control to the manual levers were unsuccessful. The Pride was returning from the Bahamas. According to the report, as the voyage wind down, command of the ship shifted from the pilot to the staff captain, or second in command. By the time they noticed the steep angle and high speeds, it was too late. The ship only suffered minor damage. Terminal staff and everyone on the ship made it out okay. Passengers saying it could have been much worse. Very lucky nobody got hurt. And the NTSB maintains it is not blaming anyone for this crash. Reporting live tonight, Amy Yancey, WJZ Eyewitness News. All right, thank you very much, Amy. The captain involved in the crash is from Maryland and has 20 years of navigation experience.